Hail the chimp. This is the chimp amplifier from BWM. Big white monkey. And as you can see, we've got high low inputs on the left. Looks like a turd on the first dial there, a peanut on the second dial, and some bananas on the third dial. Headphone socket there, standby and power. And possibly most interesting and exciting of all, the attenuator at the back there. So you can run these valves at full power and yet still not drown the place out with sound if you just want to practice quietly. A really, really good feature, often set up as an external unit, but in this case it's all internal and all ready to go. So I've got it set to about halfway there. And you can see lovely valves glowing there, ready to go. So what does it sound like? Well, the answer is pretty good. Unfortunately, that's about the best camera angle I can get for you, but we might as well look at the speaker. I'm using a Jaguar Baritone twin humbucker set. Different pickup positions. I'm just going to stay on the neck position. Personal favorite. And let's turn the turd right up. gives us a nice barking overdrive. Gee, it's moments like these where I am reminded of how much better real valves are than simulated ones. There are some great modeling amplifiers out there now that are doing a really good job and you switch them on and you go, oh, fantastic, it sounds really, really good. But honestly, every time I switch on a valve amp again, there is just that little bit extra. Let's turn that attenuator, attenuator right up. I am just reaching around to the back. So we'll get the full force of those valves. And let's return turd to its middle position and turn the peanut right up. So that's our tone control. Peanut equals tone. Deep. Trilling. Give it a little bit more turd. bananas. Let's turn bananas up. Simply master volume. So we're up on a pretty high volume there and I'm not really getting that much background noise so that's quite good. Amps, even if it is just a little one like this, and also plenty of bass response. Let's turn the tone knob down for a nice trumpety sort of sound. More of a tuba, I suppose. Trumpety is the wrong word. for all the knobs. So you can see how much character we entered into the sound there just by dialing a few settings. the chimp from BWM. It is... Well, what more can you say about it? It's small, it's reasonably light, it's got the built-in attenuator, and it's got the valves.